Bernie's socialist server. They've got equality, hunger, and pre dirt. Oh, okay. Don't call anyone by incorrect pronouns, and okay, using the word socialism. Okay, alright, alright. Four players out of twenty. Hell yeah, I need to play this right now. So today I'm going to be commentating over the first time I ever played on Bernie Sanders' Minecraft server. There are many tear jerking events that happen throughout this video, so if you are emotionally inept, whatever inept means, hold up, let me check. Inept. Lacking or showing of oh that's not that's not the word I was looking for. Yes, no, if you are if you're like TJ and your soft spot is sad anime, then this is not the place for you. But if you're into sad Minecraft videos then this is this is what the fuck am I talking about? This has gone downhill. This is quite possibly the worst intro I've ever done to any video. But anyways, I'll be with you talking and oh, covert mic switch. Upon first entering the area, I was immediately greeted by this nice guy named Smullion, and I replied hello back. I then looked around and I saw some wow. questionable content. Uh, I gotta take a closer look at this. Yep, um, I'm gonna have to censor that, I'm sorry. Excuse me, the wither? Um, no, please, you can't see that, that's bad. Oh. People <laughs> hate me. <laughs> and I went into the nether, because I found another portal, and there was too many withers in that dimension, so I realized this was the only way to go. So I proceeded to to explore, to explore the outer realm of uh, hell. Oh, 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 okay. And then I found a road, and I realized, yeah, I should probably follow that road. So I did. And then this this nice fellow was like, oh, sorry, I never said hi, which uh, caught me off guard. Wow, people are surprisingly friendly here. It's kind of kind of scaring me, if I'm being honest. Anyways, I proceeded to push off some capitalist pigs because. I thought that that would uh, go. suit the theme of this uh, socialist setting. What, tarnation? Death. So I just kept pushing them off. And then I traveled. And then I took in the sights. Very beautiful with this uh, shader pack I had on. Zero zero exit portal. I wonder what's over there. Eh, go take a look, I guess. So I went through the zero zero exit portal. And when I arrived on the other side, I found a highway with an edgy name. Thing. And then I, so then I mined a tree. I beat it up until it couldn't fight back anymore. <laughs> then I wandered around aimlessly some more, I, acting pretty lost. But then again, I had nowhere I really wanted to be. And I found this man's house. Very cool. So I took a look inside to see what he had in his chest, and there was nothing all that good. Don't worry, I wasn't gonna steal it. And then I found indoor plumbing. What? what? Oh, look, a toilet. I think I will murder this sheep. I decided, yeah, sheep, it's time for you to die. So, he died. I found another sheep. And, yeah, it was time for him to die as well. Then I found a llama. Oh, with a llama. Then I left a llama be, because... I don't know. I wonder if Bernie Sanders would be proud of this world. I bet he would be. I bet he would be, Mateo. Surely he would be. Yeah, he would be. So I went back to the, the house I'd been at earlier. W with all the resources that I had collect collected, and I read the sign... This location marks the start. It didn't make any sense. I don't know to me. what that means. So. Oh, now I'm missing one. Yeah, I found out I didn't have enough wool for a bed. So then. I guess I'll just go back to the Nether. Yeah, I decided to go back to the Nether. And on the way exploring, I got got ambushed. Ambushed oh. by a zombie and a skelly boy. No, it was not good. I thought. Is this how I go out? Really? Maybe I can't remember actually. All the ways to die. Yeah, it really does suck, Mateo, in the past tense. And then I got shot by some skeleton over in the distance. Who knows who it was or where he came from. All I know is that I died. And then I... Ah, these people are really wholesome. Yeah, I was gifted an F-chain. My first F-chain, like, ever. <laughs> really nice guys. Surprisingly. Once again, catching me off guard. But then I got a hidden message from Smoolian. Then I had to look up uh, online how to privately message him back. Because I'm an idiot. And then I came back and said, hey, can I borrow a bed if it's available there? And then I got harassed by Skellington, and I realized all I had to say was no. So I did. I said no by disconnecting. And then I reconnected to the server. And luckily for me, the skeleton had somehow magically disappeared. And I found this tower. Um, not really sure if it had some offensive uh, symbols on it. But... Uh, Whatever, I, I don't really care. It's just a tower. <laughs> wow, um, 
I'm not really sure what this is. And then I jumped off. Because why not? With all this iron. Oh, and then I almost drowned. Drowned. I almost drowned. I almost did it again. Jeez. I found this dog named Peppis. Very strange. Name for a dog. And then I found a super secret base after a, a period of time later. And then I replanted it, of course. Because that just would be rude to steal all this stuff and not replant it. And then I hit a sheep for its wool. And then I hit another sheep and slapped him. And then he gave me his wool. And that's how it works. That's how you get wool, guys. And then we, me and Smoothie and I had a nice exchange. We, wish, we wished each other luck upon our journeys. I said thank you. And I went back to that portal because I realized, hey, you know what? Why don't I just go back to that other guy's house and like improve his... Oh, and, oh my goodness, I suck at this game. So I jumped in that nether portal. I knew what I had to do. I had to get ready. I had to, uh... Okay, well, apparently I had to eat a, a lamb chop. But then I went. I went at the speed of light. No, I... Faster. I'm making these transitions weird, Mateo, in the past tense. And I traveled for many minutes. Then I went back into that exit portal. And I arrived on the other side. Back to that edgy, edgy highway. No. I thought about mining, but then I realized, holy heck, I am not now. I don't want to get molested by a <laughs> about now? So I continued. I realized I was lost, so I uh, went in search of my destination underwater, and I realized I was still lost. Then I went up on this mountain, and there was tons of llamas for some reason. Who knows why? I couldn't tell you. Do not enter. That came across this building. I think I should enter. Area 51. Mm -hmm. Area 51. Oh, we. Very cool, Mateo. But to my disappointment, it was just some sort of really dumb airport security thing. Wasn't that cool. And then I found oh, this. Oh, my goodness. Someone actually put time into this, and it's amazing. It definitely impressed me. It was a sure city way. full of apartment buildings. Wow. Well. But to my... Um, sadness. I, I was sad because there was no stuff for me to steal. So I went upstairs to look for um, oh, yeah, nice items place. to. Uh, I should take the family take. here someday. Yeah, you should take the family here someday, Mateo. In the past tense, you should. Really nice place. Yes. And I kept going. Yeah, this place is really cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I agree. I agree. By the way, you uh, you suck at this game. Oh, now you're not gonna say anything. You know what? Screw you, Mateo. Screw you. You suck. I asked who owns the small city with all the apartments. And then I went walking around and... Yeah, I'm really not sure what I was thinking here. I guess I committed to the jump. And luckily I didn't get destroyed by that creeper. So I kept exploring. Looking for something. And then... You know... Something horrible happened. I realized... That I hadn't placed my bed. So I went back. Actually, no, I didn't. I got killed like 10 seconds later. <laughs> so I decided, hey, I think it's time for me to get off. <laughs> so, after bidding my farewells, I said goodbye. Wait, no, that's not how that works. And these so-called socialists, who are probably just a bunch of memers, returned my farewells. And what I learned from this experience is that uh, nothing. I learned absolutely nothing. Chances are... I'll probably forget to place my bed in the future, and I'll get blown up by a creeper, and I'll lose all my stuff. And it'll give me big boy depression. Anyways, guys, if you did enjoy this video, leave a like. Yes, thank you. Leave a like right now. If you don't do it, I'll probably have to... I'll be sad, and uh, you don't want to do that. Sadness is an illness that you don't want to give me. I'm just kidding, I already have it. So if you you can like or dislike, actually. But leave a comment. I want to I want to hear how you're doing. So do that. Leave a comment. But most of all, I need you to subscribe. Subscribe right now. And that'll be all. Yep. No, I held no other uh, expectations upon you. You may go. Have a good day, my friend. I'll see you in the next video. At least I better. If I don't see you in the next video, I'll... We're going after Ghost Horse. That Ghost Horse has plagued me in my dreams. Oh, that's... That's not a horse. Oh. Uh, <laughs> well, that was unexpected. <laughs>